to Hayes' Amazing Life. Today we're in the midnight routine. Well, tonight. I got dressed in the unicorn forever. Alright, now I'm going to brush my teeth. Do not go to the for bubble gum. my brother and then the basement and grab a lady. Are you almost done? He's a playing around. He's also brush his teeth. Colton, hurry dude. We're on YouTube. <laughs> If you like my Amelia Bedelia, <laughs> do I want to do a video of using in another texture of that book and do my hair? Happy birthday, Beak. Uh, well, there is the ground thing. Happy birthday, Beak. Guys, it's my dolphin. She's basically taking it down here. Um, but actually, because they might make sweets here. Because I'm a little mermaid. Right now. Swish, swash, swish, swash. To the water. I like the low, low so that's a little sticker. Alright, Haley, you ready? Uh huh. Okay. I chose Amelia Bedelia. Can I read it, please? Um, no, because it's already late. Okay, 946. You want to know that sometimes you read it and sometimes I read it. 
Sometimes I read, sometimes he reads it. It depends on how late or early it is. Colton, come on, we're going to start the book. Um, I want them to see the picture first. And they're going to see how my sea room is. <clears throat> Amelia Bedelia makes her friend. Let's put your water out, please. Hey, Gordon. Please. Let's put your water out, please. Alright. I can't. Alright. I don't know. I think I'm going to turn around. Okay, it's not the tablets. Alright. Amelia Bedelia was lucky. Her best friend lived next door. Hello, Jen, said Amelia Bedelia. Yeah. Hi, Amelia Bedelia, said Jen. Amelia Bedelia and Jen had been friends since they were babies. They baked together, they dress up together, they played music together. Amelia Bedelia even showed Jen how to bowl. They played so well, to oh, they play so well together, said Amelia Bedelia's mother. They sure do, said Jen's mother, even though they are as different as night and day. Then one day, Jen and her parents moved away. Amelia Bedelia and her parents were very sad. Amelia Bedelia missed Jen. She missed Jen every day. She wished Jen would come back. One morning, a moving van pulled up. Did Jen come back? Asked Amelia Bedelia. I don't think so, said Amelia Bedelia's mother. We must have new neighbors. Amelia Bedelia's mother watched the movers. Oh, look, she said. I see a fancy footstool. <coughs> Amelia Bedelia did not look. She wanted Jen back. Look, said Amelia Bedelia's mother, I see a coffee table. Amelia Bedelia still did not look. She just kept drawing. Amelia Bedelia's mother said, I see some big armchairs. I see a love seat. I see a twin bed. Finally, Amelia Bedelia looked at Jen's old house. Then she looked at her drawings. Our new neighbors sound strange, she said. That night, Amelia Bedelia told her dad about the new neighbors. He loved her pictures. Amazing, her dad said. I hope they have a pool table. The next morning, Amelia Bedelia and her mother baked blueberry muffins. They took the muffins next door. A lady opened the door. Hello there, she said. My name is Mrs. Adams. You must be my new neighbors. No, said Amelia Bedelia. We already live here. You are my new neighbor. You know, said Mrs. Adams, I think both of us are right. Do come in. Mmm, Miss Adams said. What smells so good? My mom does, said Amelia Bedelia. I don't wear perfume yet. Jen's house looked different. Every room was full of boxes. Welcome to my mess, said Mrs. Adams. I will live out of boxes for a while. That sounded fun to Amelia Bedelia. Are the twins in their bed? Asked Amelia Bedelia. My goodness, said Mrs. Adams. You have sharp eyes. Amelia Bedelia hoped that was good. My twin grandchildren will visit today, said Mrs. Adams. Their names are Mary and Marty. The twins visited that afternoon. Our grandma is a lot of fun, they told Amelia Bedelia. They were right. It was great to have a friend right next door again. Amelia Bedelia and Mrs. Adams baked together. They dressed up together. They played music together. They have so much fun together, said Amelia Bedelia's father. They sure do, said Amelia Bedelia's mother, even though they are as different as night and day. One day, Jen came back to visit. Mrs. Adams took both girls to a real bowling alley. This is the best day ever, said Amelia Bedelia. I have a best old friend and a best new friend, and we are three best friends together. The end. Well, bye guys. I to see you. You mean BFF? Yep. See you later, alligator. Bye.